Good evening, everybody. Well, the Cannondale CAD 4 R500 is complete. So let's start from the back. Okay, it's got a nine speed free wheel. I'm sorry, cassette and a 105 uh, Shimano rear derailleur. As we move forward, it's got a, um, man, what do they call it? Truvati, I believe, Truvati uh, front crank with a 53 uh, tooth chain ring. And it's a one by system. So this is a one by nine. What else do we have on this bike? Okay, um, SRAM Apex brakes, got rid of the old uh, Tiagra brakes. A uh, power saddle with a cutout, a carbon seat post. Now let's move to the front. All right, and this is a highlight. Look, uh, mom, no cables. Yes, I upgraded and got rid of that old cable that was sticking out. And one with this new Chinese group set is called Sensei, I believe. This is a two by nine system, runs about a hundred bucks on Amazon. Uh, they had a 10% coupon. And uh, wow, made a big difference. Very easy to install. Um, you just have to read the instructions. So double click shifts up, one click shifts down. Same thing for the other side. Okay, so double shift clicks up and one click shifts down. So it's really easy, um, almost intuitive. You just gotta get out and ride it and you'll see how smooth it is. But this bike came out sweet, guys. Uh, she's down to 18 pounds um, and that's pretty good for an old CAD 4. You know, it's a aluminum frame with a carbon fork. Um, bottom bracket headset are in beautiful condition. So what's been replaced? Well, virtually everything except the cranks. And well, actually most of the crank is gone. This was a, remember, this was a three piece crank. Now it's a single speed uh, or a single chain ring. And the 105 rear derailleur, the front derailleur is gone. Uh, the brake calipers are gone. The handlebar and stem are gone. Uh, even the wheel set are gone. You know, so basically I uh, got a complete rebuild. It's super light, super fun, um, and really quick. It's totally like what Cannondale originally did, you know, the crit frames they used to make. Man, this is total crit style. And with these new shallow compact handlebars and the brake hoods are super, super comfortable. You know, it is just reminds me of my old crit frame I had back in the early 90s. And it's almost the same color. It's that blueberry color, except this one has flames. Some people like the flames. I'm not a big fan, but uh, bike came out great, guys. If you have any questions on this build, please let me know.